A night of swimming turns tragic for a group of children. Police confirm a 13-year-old drowned in the White River after he was swept away from the shore sometime before midnight. RTV6's Katie Hines is live on the southwest side with the latest. Chad, we're just learning the identity of the young victim this morning. He is 13-year-old Micah Strong of Indianapolis, and it is here along the White River under the I-70 Kentucky Avenue Bridge that police tell us he went swimming with a group of four friends late last night. Conservation officers say Strong was wading in the water when he inadvertently entered a deeper area. Strong doesn't know how to swim and started struggling, and that's when he was swept farther away from the shore. His friends, two boys and two girls, flagged down a metro police officer who happened to be driving by and we're told that officer jumped into the water to look for the boy. IFD also called out its dive team and we're told eight divers and two boats searched the water over a three hour period before pulling the boy's body from the river a little after 3 a.m. He was found about 40 yards away and this morning IFD is issuing a warning that these waters are not safe for swimming, especially at night. Um, visibility is greatly decreased. Um, and uh, with the current and uh, the debris in the river, it just makes it um, um, uh, a very bad idea to go swimming in the river. Autopsy is scheduled for later today, and we're told this investigation is ongoing, so certainly we'll bring you more details as we get them. But for now, we're live on the southwest side. Katie Hines, RTV6.